guys this is team manoj kumar now i am going to explain a problem in hacker rank python if else let us ask given an integer n perform the following conditional actions if n is odd print read if n is even and in the inclusive range of 2 to 5 print not weird if n is even and in the inclusive range of 6 to 20 print weird if n is even in greater than 20 print not weird here we will give input 3 sample input 3 we should get the output weird that is the example we should we are giving input 24 we should get the output not weird that's the example n is greater than 20 n is even so that's why it is not weird now let's go into the program see i am taking input n of input of integer data type if n percentile 2 is not equal to 0 that means which condition it's checking whether the n is even or odd then it should print weird w e i r d weird okay see in the that statement also it will be now i'm writing l if in l if condition i'm writing c n percentile 2 is equal to 0 that's uh, n is odd odd condition then it will print weird the output screen now n is even n is even means and n should be inclusive range up to 2 to 5 within lf condition will write n percentile 2 is equal to 0 and n n greater than 2 greater than or equal to 2 because we are using they use the term inclusive so we should include 2 and 5 also and n less than or equal to 5 okay elif condition we wrote uh, in that we dot print of sorry print not weird n o t w e i r d okay now again writing another elif statement so elif condition i should write within that if n percentile 2 is equal to 0 and n greater than or equal to 6 see inclusive range to 6 to 10 you should print weird Let's end it. And less than or equal to twenty. Okay. Within that ellipse, I'll write one statement. Print weird. W e i r d. Okay. Now I'm writing another ellipse statement. in c we wrote else if now we will write here else if in python n percentile 2 is equal to 0 and n greater than 20 see above condition you check now see if n is even and greater than 20 then print not weird That's the completion of program. Now I'm running the code. It's processing. Yes, uh, the two test cases are satisfied. See, we gave the input three. The output is weird. Expected output also matches the 
output. Now we see all the test cases. All the test cases are passed. That's it, guys. If the video is nice, like it and share it to your friends. And please subscribe to my channel. Thank you.